Hi, Top Network family. I'm here to talk to you about the Blue Sticky Wall. I know it's been a convenient tool that you can stick in your suitcase and travel all over the world with to help facilitate ideas and intentions, but there are some serious drawbacks. One of the key issues is maintenance and grip strength. How many times have you had to respray your wall or wrestle with masking tape when pieces of paper stubbornly continued to fall off mid-presentation? Another issue is sustainability in that we go through lots of pieces of paper and seem to duplicate effort when setting up things like a wonder wall. Another consideration is host site appropriateness as a host site may not be able to accommodate a sticky wall being pinned to their wall or taped to their wall. Or even in some cases, there may not be a free wall to use. Hi, my name is Todd Rogers. I'm a top network member out of Chicagoland and I want to share with you an idea that occurred to me about how we might be able to address these issues with a different kind of sticky wall. I call it the fuzzy wall. In a nutshell, the fuzzy wall is made up of a sturdy portable conference vendor pop-up wall frame, a six foot by 15 foot piece of felt that you can get in any color, whether the traditional blue, black, or if you get green, you can also add green screen capability to your facilitation. For the idea cards, I use various colors of laminated cardstock with Velcro coins on the back. For example, I use white eight and a half by 11 cardstock cut in half to make two idea cards. I use yellow cardstock for rules of engagement. I use orange cardstock for cluster headings. You get the picture. Cards can also be pre-printed with icons or key phrases, laminated, and stored in a travel kit for ease of use. You simply write on them with a dry erase marker in multiple colors even, and then reuse them as many times as needed. The Velcro coins provide tiger grip holds of the cards on the fuzzy wall so that you can even facilitate outdoors with confidence that you're never going to lose your ideas to the wind. And yet you can take them off and move them around with ease. The entire kit can be stored in a travel bag and taken with you wherever you go across the globe. I also think that it provides a basis for further innovation. For example, I haven't tried this yet, but if you're handy with a sewing machine, you could even create visual thinking canvases by sewing together various colors of felt so that you get a preset Wonderwall felt or an Ored felt or any of the design and visual thinking pattern forms that you can find on the internet. So if you're interested in getting more details about how to build your own fuzzy wall with Tiger Grip, shoot me an email at rogers.todd.l at gmail.com and I'll send you a PDF with links to all the resources you need on Amazon. Thanks.